Dear students, welcome to today's class. Let us learn today about the sentence. What is a sentence? A sentence is a group of words that makes complete sense. So sentence is a group of words that gives us complete meaning, that gives us complete sense. Look at these, these books. It is a group of words, but it does not give us complete sense. It gives us only some sense, therefore it is not a sentence. Whereas, look at this. I love to read these books. It is a group of words which gives us complete meaning. Therefore, it is a sentence. So, sentence is made up of two parts, namely subject and predicate. What is subject? The doer of the action of the verb is called subject. And what is predicate? It is the part of the sentence that tells us something about the subject. So subject is the doer and predicate that tells us something about the subject. Let's try to understand through the example. The lion is the king of the jungle. So here the lion is subject and is the king of the jungle is predicate. Now let's look at direct and indirect object. So the predicate in the sentence may have more words than only a verb. Sometimes there are words after the verb that complete the meaning of the sentence, such as the words, phrases or clauses that complete the meaning of the sentence and express the goal or the result of the action of the verb are known as object of the verbs. So there are two types of objects. First, direct object. What is direct object? A noun or pronoun that takes the action of the verb or the result of the action of the verb is called direct object. This noun or pronoun is the answer if you ask what or whom after verb. So in order to find out direct object you have to ask what or whom after the verb. For example, I love cake. So here I is subject, love is verb and cake is object which is direct object. Second, indirect object. Verbs such as give, bring, tell, take or buy both take both direct and indirect object. An indirect object is a noun or pronoun that is not used with a preposition in the sentence. Let's see the example. She gave me the report. So she is subject, gave is verb, me is object indirect object and the report is also object which is direct object. Now let's see the types of sentences. There are mainly four types of sentences. First declarative sentences which state something. Second interrogative sentences which ask something. Third, imperative sentence which express a command, request, advice, etc. And fourth, lastly, exclamatory sentences which express a strong emotion or feeling. Now, there are two types of declarative sentences, namely affirmative sentence and negative sentence. So, affirmative sentence, for example, I like puppies. This is a positive sentence and Negative sentence, for example, I do not like puppies. So it is negative sentence. Now let's look at interrogative sentences. There are two types mainly yes or no questions and wh questions. For example, in the yes no questions, do you like reading books? So answer could be yes or no. And wh questions, 
which book do you like to read in wh questions what which who whose whom etc now let's look at imperative sentences there are different kinds command for example sit down request please close the door advise for example wear a helmet while riding a motorcycle so in this way we have seen what is sentence direct and indirect object and types of sentences so that's all for today thank you